We're now going to talk about the basic row operations and provide some definitions for them. So if we have a matrix and it has some rows, what we do is we define this to be row 1 and this to be row 2. We use these little subscripts to tell us which one it is and the R says that it's a row. And so we're going to use this notation and the three things that we can do, there are three basic operators, we can interchange rows In other words, we can take row i and we draw a double arrow to row j and it says row i becomes row j and row j becomes row i. They just trade places. Two, we can multiply a row by a non-zero constant. And we write this as a row i gets stored in row i. And three, the last basic row operator, there are others, but these are the three that we're going to use, is that we can add a multiple of one row to another row, and we write this as a row i plus row j, and we're going to store that typically in row j. It has to be stored somewhere, but we're going to put it in row j, the one that we're not modifying. And so these are the three things that you can do when using row operations. These are the three basic row operations that you need to know.